How's it going everyone? My name is Snowy and welcome to a game called Death Trash. I saw this game probably a couple weeks ago over on Twitter, maybe like a couple months ago now actually. It's been, apparently it's been worked on by one single guy for the last five years now alone. Uh, so it is in early access, it's near release I believe, semi near release, but it has been catching my eye a little bit. It's been a, a pretty decent story game from what I've seen. I know absolutely nothing about it except that there's a big trash monster that likes to eat things, and uh, I think you fight things. I don't- I don't know what's going on whatsoever. There's puking noises. And look, if you come- if you come over here, you can actually see- where is it, where is it, where is it? You can see right here, it says mute puking. <laughs> you can genuinely mute the noises of puking for your viewing pleasure. I'm gonna leave it on. All we have left to do, really, is start a new game. Do we want to go relax? No! Standard, maybe? Hard? I don't know, dude. I don't know, extra challenges, we'll ignore those for now. You could change the difficulty at any time, apparently. Um, I think since this is a story game, we want to get more of the story, so we'll just go with standard. As usual, uh, we're gonna be a little basic boitch. Planet Nexus, centuries after falling? Amongst remnants of old civilians. Okay. Humanity rests in silent cities. I like the whole text and, like, pixelated. Normally, I don't like pixelated games very much, but... I don't know. This one just kind of caught my eye. While machines wander, passing judgment. And the outcasts try to survive. That's pretty cool. Choose your character? Okay. Do we get to add stats, I guess? Finesse. What? Allows the use of better ranged weapons, better crit chances with ranged weapons. I kind of like that one. Occultism? Allows the use of abilities that communicate with the flesh? I don't even know what that means. Increased focus energy for all abilities. That's interesting. I might look into that one more. Cybertech allows the use of most forms of implants and tech abilities. So it'll give us access to like more of the upgrades, I want to say. And empathy influence some characters with interactions with other characters. Okay, we'll do some empathy. Uh, we'll do some finesse because I really like the idea of using ranged weapons. And then we'll do some occultism because, you know, the abilities boosting. I think it's more of an overall thing. And, uh, why not cybertech? Sure. And then skills. We have animalism, bartering, melee blunt, melee sharp, small guns, rifles, high tech, stealth, lock picking, and pickpocketing. I didn't need to read all those out. <laughs> I'm going to figure out which ones I want to upgrade. Uh, backstabbing damage is four times. Yes, please. Lock picking. You know we're going to need that. Pickpocketing, possibly. Uh, we're gonna do rifles, and then we're gonna do... Mm, I don't know. I wanna do animals. I kinda like animals. The idea of animals. Also, we're gonna need some more stealth, baby. I like the idea of lock picking, because I feel like we'll get more stuff out of that. Choose your character. <sighs> There's a lot of work that goes into this. Uh, sweet baby snowy. Nope, it doesn't let me put those characters. Baby Snowy it is. I kind of like this character. It's kind of like the main character, I guess you could see on the game and stuff like that. Uh, skin color, ooh, pure white. <whistles> he needs some sunscreen. All right, this overall looks pretty decent. I mean, the blue hair is kind of a vibe, not gonna lie. Uh, what, what do we even pick? Mustache man? I think I like the blue beard guy. I love him. Uh, accent color, ooh. Like a icy blue white kind of color and then cloth color. We're trying to be sneaky, right? I think the dark the black looks really cool. That's like we're Darth Vader, but blue. Here we are in a dungeon I can kind of drag my mask around to walk around or I can use Wazd to move around the door opened up for me Okay Try pressing space to roll. Ooh, we get around faster. We have a, um, a Little bar down here press E to use this machine, what is this machine? It looks broken. I don't know, we'll probably fix it, I assume, right? That's usually how games work. Nice, baby, got some trash. More trash? Is that blood? Can't reload, no range, oh, I hit the wrong button. Yeah, this is not mine. Interesting, wait, so does he live here? Is that a toilet right there? That might be a toilet. What do we do now? Hello, who are you? Welcome, former citizen. It looks like the operation has been successful. Do you remember who you are? Yes, I do. That is fortunate. We still take interest in your well-being. 
However, you have to leave us now. The danger of a possible containment or contamination cannot be ignored. Please don't try to return to your old habitat. We have put security measures in place to prevent this. What security measures? So what happens to me now? Where should I go? Let's uh, let's kind of dig a little bit. Figure out what security measures is going on. Your body will malfunction permanently when nearing one of our habitats. So what happens to me now? Where should I go? Okay, he rounds it. All the answers. This is not for us to answer. You're free to go anywhere as long as you don't try to enter a habitat. Here is all relevant info for you in written form in case you forget. More reading. We encourage you now to follow the surface integration course, but you're free to leave anytime you want. I want to take that course or I'll leave. Let's uh leave because we can just revisit it. All right, just follow the small corridor to section two. I think I think we can take to the orientation probably sometime in the future, right? Goodbye. Goodbye. He seemed friendlier than I thought. Move along. Move along. They're all going to have the same voice, except for that one. He's our friend. More trash. I like the sound of that. Uh, we have... What do we have? Oh, there's another door. We went to the wrong place! Oh, we can just go back, can't we? I believe we can. Awakening. Oh, that's just the area. Um, Where are we now? Missing item lockpick? But we have the lockpicking ability. See? I told you it would come in handy. I absolutely told you it would come in handy. Definitely. I definitely said that. Definitely said that in the past sometime at one point. I don't want to go that way because there's a red line there. We were told to go to the corridor to the left, correct? I keep hitting R instead of E. Caves. Er, caves. Is this a shotgun? That will come in handy. So will this. Wooden cudgel? I don't know. Nano health. What is this? What is happening right now? Space take all, I assume? Um, do we have an inventory? I for inventory? No. Okay. Tab for inventory? It is. It's tab. So we can equip range weapon. We can equip, I don't know, body armor and maybe a trinket. Uh, melee weapon. How do we use these though? And there's also the, uh, the text that they gave us. All right. So this is, makes me curious. Why is it flashing red? Oh, I just hacked it. Wait, what happened? I'm very confused here. What do we just unlock? Oh, I don't feel so well. Oh, is this one of the... Blurg. Blur. I should get this fixed. Maybe there's a doctor out there somewhere. But wait. I've been contaminated. I don't feel too good. Is that a gun there? No, it's not. Nice and cozy. A bit dirty. Um, what if we go back in and do a little bit of exploring? What's over here? Lots of blood. Surface integration course. Course? I think. These are all just disgusting, aren't they? Just piles of blood. Hold shift and use right, left click for melee attack from current position. Oh, look, we can beat him with our stick. <laughs> this had to be done. Okay. Med ingredients. Can we collect them? All right, that's cool. What about this though? Uh, trash and organs. <gasps> we can collect organs. I like the sound of that. My liver's been dying lately. I mean, I could use a new one. Uh, what happens if we wrap around over here? Oh, look at that sick dodge! I died. I don't even know the controls of this game, and I died. Well, that makes sense. I mean, that's just. Oh, look at that, baby. Dodge. Oh, dodge. Okay, I, I got hit once. Um, I have 19 out of 50 health. What do we do about that? Inventory? I don't know. Med ingredients. Oh, he only has trash this time. He doesn't have organs. Where do we... What? There's so many things. Crafting resource. Okay. Uh, body. We have a hood. Cloaks you from being immediately seen by other characters. I like the sound of that. Does that mean we get to, like, get the first hit every single time on characters? Nope. Apparently not. I just died again. What the heck? What am I supposed to do? I swung! Something tells me that it was a good idea not to put it on hard mode. I mean, it's just a thought. Hold shift and right click to use a melee attack from current position. All right, so when he reaches up is the time to dodge. Uh, but also, I have three health, and I don't think I'm going to last very long. 
What do we do about that? What if we just run by him? Do we really have to, like, fight him? I think we do. Locked. Maybe we can strategic. Never mind. I have a gun. This whole time I've had a gun. How do I use the gun? Oh, right clicking uses the gun. Okay. Bang. 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 Oh, that was so much easier. How many bullets do I have left? I have two. Let's reload. <laughs> Let's take the med ingredients. What if we shoot him once and then go in for the, the melee kill just to save on bullets? Bang. And then we shift and hit. Shift one more. Yeah, look at We took no damage. Uh, we're a little low, but we took no damage. <gasps> yes. Give me all the health. Give me all. All of the health. Uh, plus 15 health. I will 100% eat that meat goop. I'll take that with me. Thank you. Can we go through this door now? Uh, tab. And then click on the body tab. Equip the stealth module. I will 100% do that. Close inventory. Locked. 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 Toggle stealth with alt. I feel like they're telling me these controls a little bit too late. Oh man, I'm stealth now. I feel like I could have used this earlier. I would have appreciated to have this before, you know, before I fought the monsters. That would have been nice. What is this? A body? Give me that. Can you just click through the entire game? Damned flesh everywhere. All right, let's go down here. Let's uh, let's go ahead and exit. I might have missed some things, but that's all right. What is this? Yeah, you could legitimately just click through the entire game, which is 100% okay with me. There's little tiny meat rats. Hey, who are you? And what are you doing here? Could ask the same to you. I live here. I'm the... <laughs> I live here and guard the flesh kraken. Now what are you doing here? Say nothing? Or I came from back there, the facility. Um... What if he finds out that we're back there and he thinks I'm a bad guy? Maybe I was mind controlled in some way that I don't understand? Or maybe these are the bad guys and they're actually saving civilization. Um, let's say nothing. Will, will you hurt me? See, he's scared of us. Uh, say nothing. Do I keep saying nothing and kind of like swindle my way into a little persuasion? Nah. No, I wouldn't do that. Phew. I'm glad. I won't hurt you either. I just care for the flesh cracking. Uh, empathy, one out of two. Requirement on that. What about your flesh... Or about your flesh... Flesh cracking. What? It's not mine. Look, you could talk to him if you want. He's a bit moody these days. Oh, man. I would love to talk to him, but I'm not empathetic enough. I feel your pain, brother. I feel it enough to talk to your cracking. Frick. Oh, he makes the sound effects. That's a... My mouse froze. That's a lot of flesh. What kind of animal are you? Uh, so what do you do all day? Yes. What do you do all day? Bondering. He can't have the robot voice, guys. If I give him the robot voice, and the robots are going to be pointless. <gasps> what if he's controlling the robots? He's been controlling everything all along. That's why everything ended up the way it was. About what? Life? Eternity? Hmm. What else could there be? Friendship, society, amusement. I don't know what voice that was. I'm giving him like a beefy voice, I guess. <laughs> what the hell? You have no friends? Or you have friends? Friends. You. Oh, yes. Absolutely. Friend. Search friends? You want more? Search friends. Um. Does he trust me now? Is he like a child? Is this a, a meat child? Is that what I'm seeing here? I mean, friends aren't exactly my problem. But I'll help. I kind of appreciate, you know, having a giant flesh crack and be my friend. That would be nice. Come in handy when the school bullies come around and ask for my lunch money again. Probably won't be easy, though, considering your circumstances. Okay. Hey, you. Will you be his friend? 
You can stay here if you want. I don't mind. The Kraken needs friends. You think? I mean, he's stuck here. I suppose he might not like, or he might like to have someone to talk to other than me. He can't get out? No. And I don't know how they got him in here in the first place. I just, I just take care of him. Do you know of any other beings that are similar to him? I heard rumors about an eye as big as a house and mountains of flesh, but I don't know where they are. Maybe you could ask around Taurus? It's to the east of here. I don't know how to read. Okay. Um, I would like to click this one, but I don't have empathy. You know, I don't feel bad enough for you guys to care. You can save the game manually when not in combat. Okay, so escape and we can save. Uh, free slot. Alright, that's cool. That's a pretty cool feature. Although it doesn't save automatically like all the time, so it's kind of uh, scary. Is that a quick teleportation machine? My mouse is messing up, I apologize. I, I believe it's a quick travel thing. That's pretty cool. It kind of looks like a, a puppy. Like a little black lab. I think that's a pretty good introduction to the game itself. I've been recording for about 20 minutes now. I mean, it's not much for a first series video, uh, but we're going to be trying out this guy. He says he can edit videos for me possibly in the future. Just kind of wanted to test that out. I'll leave links to his Fiverr account if you guys are interested. If you guys liked what you saw, possibly. Links in the description because it's pretty cool that he's offering up his services and stuff like that. Uh, so if you guys want to check him out, they'll be below. Thank you guys for watching. If you're new here, more welcome to subscribe. If you liked it, go ahead and freeze that like button for me real quick. Thank you very much. Join the Discord, the Arctic Circle. The link is in the description. And as always, I will catch you guys in the next video. See ya.